this is an ear training video. The video is specifically made for me to engage with my ears. So I will sing a melody on the with my mouth and try to replicate the melody on my soprano saxophone. This exercise is specifically important because it helps me to be able to hear a pitch in my head and know exactly where it is on the soprano saxophone. If you started on an alto or a tenor saxophone, this exercise might come, might be very easy for you to do. But if you are new on the soprano, this is going to be challenging because the pitches you hear and your fingers might trick you to go to set to a certain key, but you might discover that it sounds pretty different from what you heard in your head. So it's a very important exercise. And because it is so important, it is easy, it is good to start very slowly and do very easy um, intervals. So I'm going to start with a C major scale. I'll play a C major scale. Um, and then I'll try to sing melodies out of the C major scale and try to play them on the instrument. Do re mi fa sol la ti do ti la so fa mi re do la 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 so this is the door.
So there's no shame in not being able to hear the pitches correctly. As you can hear, sometimes my, my ear deceives me and I think I have the right fingering and then I discover, oh, oh, oh no, this is not right. And then I try to correct it. So if you're doing it for yourself, you should also be very honest with yourself and say, no, I didn't hear this correctly or repeat it. Or if you, if you think it's a guest work, then you do it a, a couple of times to repeat it just to affirm to yourself that you've heard the correct pitch that you are trying to replicate. Did it? Nah, I forgot to my door. Okay. I'm not sure that's what I, I sang actually. Anyways. So another way to do this kind of exercise would be to transcribe a melody. In previous videos, I've transcribed uh, melodies from Steve Lacey, uh, Sam Newsom, and Branford Marsalis, uh, and of course, Sidney Bechet. So in subsequent, say, uh, practice sessions, transcriptions uh, sessions, or ear training sessions, it's important to either use this method or go back to those transcriptions and just transcribe something small and see how much your ears can pick, you know, the melody or how your ears can hear the pitches. Because it is different on the soprano if you are coming from the alto especially, because it's a transposing instrument and the pitch is relatively higher on the soprano than it is on the alto. So your ears will have to make those adjustments to be able to play the notes correctly. So if you like my content, I would encourage you to subscribe to my channel to enable me grow this channel. And if you have comments and suggestions on how to do ear training on the soprano, please don't forget to leave your comments below. Thank you very much for listening.